Hi guys, today I'm taking you behind the scenes of my AI-powered short film Reflections of Desire. This film got awarded at the New York International Film Awards, also was selected and exhibited at the AI Content Festival held in Seoul, South Korea, and was featured in workshops on AI film production. I show you how I use ChatGPT for writing, Midjourney for visuals, Runway Gen 3 for video synthesis, and Eleven Labs and Suno AI for sound design. From concept to final cut, I will guide you through every single step. So let's dive in and see what these AI tools can create. So from the scratch, we need an idea for the film. You can just ask GPT with basic information like running time and tools we are going to use. Then GPT gives us some ideas. As you can see, titles, plots, and many other components. This is pretty cool, but normally first few ideas from GPT is not very satisfying in my experience. So let's ask more to push GPT forward. I emphasize that it should be attracting the audience. Here's a tip. Try to add philosophical concept. I found GPT creates comparably well-made story when we demand some philosophical approaches. So I told it it's of the theory of desire and the mirror stage by Jacques Lacan who's a French philosopher. I don't know much about uh, philosophy, to be honest, but let's just make our story fancier, okay? After that, I've got a pretty nice story. It is satisfying enough. I've got a title, plot, theme, visual style, and even philosophical element. You can ask however you want, even you've got a nice one already. Then you need more detailed information for your characters and the environment. I only asked main character information and got character's name, age, personality, physical traits, even a symbolic item. We do the same process for the environment. I wanted to see a rough movie poster to visualize briefly, but DALI, which is the GPT image generating tool, doesn't do the best job for image creation. We are gonna use Mid Journey later. Okay, now we make the shot list, which includes the type of shots like wide shot, medium, close-up shot, and uh, description, purpose of shot, camera movement. It's very useful when we create videos using Runway Gen 3, so I recommend to make it a table or Excel file for making videos later. You can just ask GPT to do that. Lastly, I just made sure what genre is this film, and did other things to polish the story like making the log line, specifying the concept. It's also very helpful when we introduce our film to others. And I added another character like what I did for main character before. Just play with GPT to make your film story and the components. Not only with AI, also you can share this with your family, friends, strangers, your dogs, anyone. Just have fun in this first stage. This story making process is most important part in the film making processes. Make sure you have a decent story before going to the next step. Step 2. Generating images. Let's open Mint Journey website. I'll show you how I created the main character Minji. As you can see, I tried so many times to make the proper one. We need prompts to create images. The easy way to get this is using ChatGPT again. Let's go back to GPT real quick. I asked GPT to make the mid-journey prompt, 10 images for each scene. So I used this prompt for the base, created characters and the environment. What's most important in generating images is the consistency. Here's how to keep maintaining the consistent look in character generations. First, select the base character image. I liked this image, so I set it as a reference. Then click this add image icon. Drag our base image and drop it. Move our cursor here and select this avatar icon. Then you need to type this prompt dash dash CW0. CW means character weight. And the number we can put between 0 to 100. Only natural number. 0 only affects facial information. 100 affects also clothes and hair information. So you can control how much your reference image affects your output image. In the same process, I generated sub-character Soyeon as well, with the consistency. The character's outfit, I said loose paint, splattered white t-shirts, and light blue jean for Minji. Slick black blouse and pants for Soyeon. Okay, now we have our character consistency. 
Let's move on to the environment part. Three main environments in this film. Minju's painting room, antique shop, and the art gallery. I want different mood and color tone each of them. So dark mood and blue tone for Minju's room. Mysterious and yellowish golden color for antique shop. And the art gallery has modern mood and, and white and bright color tone. Based on this information, GPT is still making 10 images for each scene. The result is pretty good actually. But what I saw in the generated images is the character mostly on the center and looking toward the camera. It makes the scene boring. So here's a tip for generating images. Try to be variable for angles, shots, positions. I made characters to look other things, not only the camera. Got more environment shots and position the characters on the left and right, not only on the center. If you don't ask this, mid-journey prompts by GPT could make boring shots. Try to be variable. This will make your scene dynamic. Now it's time to make videos. Step 3. I used the Runway Gen 3 Alpha for this film. I will show you how I used this. We generated videos from the images we made in mid-journey. This image to video generation is more stable than text to video. I start with scene 1. Video generation is pretty simple. Just put the image, generate. You can generate videos without prompt, but for better quality, you can type. So here's a tip for generating videos. Use the preset. Here are presets for video prompt made by Runway. You can choose various shot presets and change description. Also add some prompt you need to. I like to add prompt, muted color, and natural movement for almost every generation. But those make the result usually better. It's the last part. Let's move to the sound design. I used Suno AI for background music, Leven Labs to generate dialogues. Suno AI is relatively simple to use. I checked instrumental because didn't need the lyrics. Simply describe the film story and mood. Generate few times and I chose the right one. For the dialogue, I got helped by GPT again. And here's a tip again. Write dialogues like you write novel. I mean, don't type only speech. Type the whole description. That guides you to the right output. In shock, whispering in disbelief. No, 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 no. So Yon, what have I done? Okay, now just gather everything into DaVinci or Premiere Pro, whatever you'd like editing tool, resize the ratio, cut our clips, color grading, then render it. You've made full AI generated film. Enjoy watching your film and share with your friends, apply film festivals, get awarded, be famous, have fun, and also show me what you've created. I'd love to watch them. Hope this video is helpful and I will see you on the next video. Bye.